Hello, everybody, and welcome back to more of Nick Plays Skyward Sword. Uh, yeah, we just got to the surface world. As you can tell, I still haven't figured out how to look around properly. Anyways, Phi wants to talk to me because my sword's glowing, so we'll see. Your hearts have decreased quite dramatically. Replenish some of your life at the earliest opportunity. Like that. What do you want, Phi? Uh, I have information to report. Cool. Uh, they were open recently, but shields sealed shut. So I guess we're just gonna make our way... I mean, I could go down there. Is that where I want to go, though? I really don't know where I'm supposed to be going, to be honest. I see there's a bug there. This is the dead end. Of course it is. I guess I'm just gonna... Go down. I, I don't know what else to do, like... Like, really, what, what am I supposed to go down there? That door sealed shut, so I have no idea. Like, if I awaken that guy right now, which I think his name was... I don't remember what his name is. Oh, well, whatever. No, I can, I, can, I can already tell this is going to be very interesting of a game to play. Considering I suck at the, uh, the controls and whatnot. Um... Yep, let's go wake this guy up. I think that's what I'm supposed to do, but I actually don't know. Young one. Child of destiny descended from the sky. This guy talked way too slow. Raise the sword of the goddess skyward. Take aim at the evil aura and unleash its power. Okay, so it has the three symbols. I see, I think that's Nehru and Din. Geysers! Master Link, I'm sensing a change in the air that was triggered by... Okay, cool. Oh. Explain this process to you. Yes, I need to know what dousing means. As you wish. Cool. Uh, when I detect the presence of, of the R or something you wish to search for using the tip of the sword. The nearer you are to an object emitting an R in question, the stronger the response will be. <laughs> the reaction of this object emitting a pointer, purple pointer you see. Hold and select your dust to point the direction you wish to search. She's like right there.
I, yeah, I don't know where exactly I'm going or what I'm doing. She's up there somewhere. Which is weird. So she's behind this door. That's definitely Sheikah magic. It's it definitely looks like Sheikah magic. Like I don't know what else to say. Sealed temple. Well, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to save my game. Yes, save. Cool, I don't like how I have this actually manually save. So this looks very familiar. <laughs> like it kind of looks like the Temple of Light. I uh, welcome you, child of fate. Why do you guys all talk so slow? Where are your eyes? This is creepy. Your hair is kind of weird, too. What is your name? Link! My name is Link! My name Link. <laughs> I am fit to bear the blade. I have sat here for many years waiting for you to arrive. Uh, I could fulfill my purpose as your guide. Uh. Uh, roof of the Seal Temple, a place built by the goddess an eternity ago. Your arrival here was predestined many, many years ago. A spirit made and you seek arrived here shortly before you, descending to this land in a shower of light. Uh, the gears of fate have begun to turn. Yeah, not all as it should be. Yeah, that's true. Not meant to reach this land in the manner she did. I feel an evil power working in the shadows. Moves to warp the destiny of which you two are, are a part of. Link, you are concerned for the spirit maiden and seek her whereabouts. Yes, that is understandable. For now, you must focus on... Okay, cool. Uh, she has her own purpose. Farron Woods. Now, if you guys have played Twilight Princess, Farron Woods makes sense. Whereas in the other games, Farron Woods does... It's not Farron Woods. Uh, create beacons. Column light will set it. Look, it's actually your waypoint from afar. Okay. Use your beacons. So she's opening the door and she said there's a treasure chest. Go oh, bravely. Okay, so she said there's a treasure chest. I don't know if you guys can see what's back there, but it looks like there's a giant red gem. I have a feeling that might be, uh, Din. Revitalize the potion. Nice. Okay, so that's good to have. I mean, it's whatever right now. 
Let's go through this door. So apparently that beacon's gonna be there, which, I mean, for most games, whenever you place a beacon down, there will always be a beacon. Look, there it is. Uh, Fi's gonna wanna talk to me any second now, isn't she? No, okay. Ah, there we go. It's a Goron and some Moblins. Okay, let's see how well I can do this. Die word strike. Cool. So the Gorons are native to the, the surface worlds of Legend of Zelda. So I guess the Helians were the ones who lived in Skyloft. And then, yeah. Yeah. Uh, he's gonna tell me something cool. Oh my goodness. I'm Gorko the Goron. Uh, there's some kind of place up above called the Isle of the Gods, far up in the sky. Uh, so, statue serves landmarks to show Activate all the other statues. Uh, yeah. Yeah, sure, I want to know more. Sounds like a fellow connoisseur of ancient cultures. No, yes. This is because I love lore for video games. That's literally why. It's going to blow my mind. People actually live on the sky and they get around by flying on the backs of huge birds that are way bigger than birds down here. Yes. Uh, reverse the guards and the residents of all the islands of the sky live in a perfect society, totally free of conflict or unhappiness. Uh, their civilization is way, way more advanced than ours down here. Stop uh, this isle of the gods even more stuff to marvel at. The place was crafted by the goddess herself, so it figures that it would fill the wonders we do not have here. Uh, buildings are all made of gold. No, and the spring of mystical water feeds the river through the place. One step to the study is left forever. No. No. Yeah. Sure, let's hear more. Good to hear. I'm completely obsessed with this place. Get enough of it. Okay, next time I bump into you, I'll give you more the latest info. Cool. Whoa! I just stunned him. What in the world just happened? Did you use some kind of magic? Yes. Statue after the moment you got near it, bud. How crazy. Alright. Okay, save. And you know what? That is actually good s three hours. Wow. Three hours of playing. But that's also because I've idled a lot. Goro. What was that? Statue reacted to you. What do you just do? Come on, do not make... The big guy beg I got to know. I'm not gonna tell you. Sorry. I see something there. Oh, I guess that this is the way I get back. I think. But you know what? This is a good place to end. So we met our first Goron. That's cool. There we go. So now we can get back up here whenever I want. Alright, but yes, this is a good place to end, so we'll continue this next time, so be sure to stay tuned for that. Uh, if you guys want to be notified when the next video goes up, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. Okay. Cool. Uh, also, if you guys are clicking on stuff, make sure you guys click on the links down in the description to follow me on social media and on Twitch. There you have it. More Skyward Sword. Be sure to stay tuned for more. 
Anyways, thank you guys for watching this episode. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.